It's Rabbi Aaron Box again here in uh, Ocala, Florida. So I just spent uh, with my family uh, five days in the mountains of Cleveland, Georgia at uh, URJ Camp Coleman, which is the host of an amazing, amazing program called Camp Jenny, uh, which started in 1988. Uh, it was started by David Haller, Andrew Frank, and a, f a couple others. Uh, and this was a, 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 it's a mitzvah core, a social justice program uh, that was created because uh, Jenny Rosenthal was uh, a young lady who was killed, unfortunately, uh, and her friends wanted to honor her life uh, with some sort of program that she would have loved, that she would have been a part of. And so they came up with this program called Camp Jenny. And it's uh, uh, started by the, what was it at the time, the Southeast Federation of Temple Youth. Um, it's uh, the southern region, the southeastern region of the National Federation of Temple Youth, NIFTI. And uh, the internet, I guess it's North American Federation Temple Youth, not just not just national. And um, sh this program was taking children, um, bringing children, not taking children, bringing children, the best students, attendance, grades, attitude, and so on and so forth, from an, a, a, a inner city school called, at the time, Fellowship Elementary School in uh, downtown Atlanta, and bringing them up to Camp Coleman. Uh, for a weekend and allowing them to have all of the same opportunities and experiences that anybody has when they go to summer camp. So they had three meals a day and snacks. They had water play. They had uh, sports and uh, arts and crafts and science and all these wonderful things that you could do at camp. Zip line. Well, they didn't do that in 88, but now. Uh, and um, just an opportunity for the kids to really be kids and this program was conducted or led by members of high school students, members of the Southeast Federation Temple Youth, with the guidance and, and, and uh, direction of adults in the region who were youth group advisors, the assistant camp director at Camp Coleman. But it was really, really led by these high school students. And um, like I said, the first year was 1988. I was a counselor in 1993 and 1994. I was representing the Columbia Federation of Temple Youth, COFTI. Um, and it was, those two experiences were uh, absolutely two of the most amazing experiences of my life. Really uh, enabled me to get to be with these kids and to, and to show them the, the love and the care and the safety and the fun that they may not have had um uh, in their daily lives and uh, it was just so anyway let's fast forward a number of years I'm a rabbi now in 2012 and 2013 rolls around and I become an adult staff member um, I've worked in in uh, for the sports program I've worked with ropes and the last six or seven years I've been working on the security team and my whole family goes with me so uh, Bacha all three of the kids and uh, this year uh, was, was our oldest, Carly's, second year as a staff member, but her first year as a counselor in the cabin. And to watch her interact with her campers uh, was, was just, it, it was just heartwarming. Um, and uh, it, 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 really gave, it really gives these kids from Florida and Georgia, South Carolina, Tennessee and Alabama, Really, and North Carolina, it really gives them a chance to to see the world through the eyes of different children. When I mean by different children, I mean ch children who come from a different background than they've come from. And uh, it, it, every year it grows and it becomes a, a larger program and there's so much that goes on. Uh, this year we had, um, not only did we have teachers from the school, but we also had children of teachers from the school who were also uh, a part of the camp and it really was uh, just a, a tremendous very very tiring um, Danica and Akiva were a part of kids club which is the uh, the group of kids who are uh, children of, of, of adult staff members like myself like Bacha 
I told you Carly was already in a cat. Well, Carly was in a cabin, and um, this year we had some kids, as I said, from the teachers of F, of this elementary school that were also in kids clubs. So it really was. It really is such a, a tremendous organization. And David Haller, re, and Andrew Frank, and all the others that started the program back in the late '80s really. Uh, incredibly hard to do so much for these kids um it's called camp jenny you go to campjenny.org you can check it out um, both carly and i and many many hundreds or thousands of teens in the southeast hold fundraisers throughout the year uh, it costs about seventy-five thousand dollars every year to run camp jenny because of you know the food and the, the security and and all the other things that go along renting the camp and uh, an amazing, awesome, awesome experience. Um, you know, as a security person, I'm really on the back in the background. Uh, my job is to keep, you know, keep the keep, keep the kids safe and secure, and and as well as the staff. And and so I don't get the 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 one on one experience that the, that the counselors get, but I really get to sit back and sort of watch them work. And uh, I see these high school students and these college students who are RAs working with these high school students. And I just I'm, I'm amazed and I'm totally excited about um, what what's going to happen moving forward, because uh, these are the kids that are going to be the leaders in, in the world. And um, I hope we can expand Camp Jenny even more uh, and and, you know, maybe find some of the alumni of Camp Jenny, because Camp Jenny is, uh, I think it's kindergarten through fifth grade, or first through fifth grade, or second through fifth grade, and, uh, you know, maybe getting some of the alumni to come back in some function, or some way, some role, um, it just, it, it, it's, it's really, I mean, the kids are there for three nights, they come in Saturday, Friday, they leave uh, Monday, so Friday, Saturday, Sunday night, and they, the relationships that they form with these high school students in three nights, four days is, is truly, truly amazing. And, um, it's, it's a great program. And I'm so excited that, that I get to be a part of it every year and my family gets to be a part of it every year. And, uh, I hope that we can continue with Camp Jenny for many, 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 many years to come. And, uh, yeah, check us out. You, uh, campjenny.org. Uh, do a search for Camp Jenny uh, online, and uh, it's great. I hope you have a great rest of your week, and uh, I'll speak with you next week.